Welcome to the Easy Computer Fixes channel and in this series where we will talk about tools to remove malware, adware, viruses, rootkits. We are going to of course show you different pieces of software that you can use to fix computers that are infected. And today we're talking about TDSS Killer. It's a free rootkit removal tool from Kaspersky Labs. Now this, um, if you're looking for the link, first of all, it will be posted with the description below the video on YouTube. It is a very specialized piece of software uh, as it is made to remove boot kits and Trojans um, in root kits. A root kit is a specialized piece of software. Most of the root kits want to be totally undetected by your antivirus because they usually want to do something in the background without you noticing. Uh, for example, it can be to steal your personal data, uh, credit card information, uh, steal passwords. It can also be there waiting for commands. For example, maybe someone somewhere has control over it to attack websites and bring them down. Um, and, you know, there's a lot of things that rootkits can do. They can be there just to download malware to your computer. So Kaspersky Labs TDSS Killer is one of the tools you should have with you when you go and scan for viruses on computers. There are different types of viruses and malware and that's why different tools are sometimes required. Um, antiviruses don't always see everything and uh, even malware software. That's why sometimes a specialized, specialized tool like this one is needed. So what you need to do is go to this page. It will require you to enter your name, first name, last name and email and they send you the download link through email which will send you to of course this page here where you can download the TDSS killer uh, you can click the exe file and run this file now if your computer is infected be very careful because most computers infected with malware and rootkits tend to redirect you to the wrong pages and the wrong downloads and because of that you will of course receive the wrong file. So if an antivirus on your computer states that when you download this it is a virus, that means you are very very infected. It is very important. Download it from another computer, put it on a USB key or a CD, better on a CD because it cannot infect a CD if you put it in your computer. Uh, if you use a USB key, make sure that you uh, clean it and reformat it after because any malware and rootkits can, of course, infect your USB thumb drive. It will bring you to this little piece of software that looks like this, where you'll click Start Scan button. The scan is usually quite fast, so it's not you know, a question of hours. It's just a question of a few minutes. It will uh, really you know, check specific items in your computer to see if you are infected by malware. Um, as I said, this is one of the pieces of software that you should actually download. It is free and will detect very specialized pieces of uh, rootkits, malware and viruses. Once the scan is done, it will of course remove whatever you have in the uh, rootkits and viruses on your computer and will prompt you for a reboot. One other uh, thing that you can actually do, but I rarely do this, is click the change parameters. You also have an option to click loaded modules, which means that at startup, it's going to look at everything that's booting on your computer to make sure that they're not infected by malware. But this will require the program to install a special driver, and that's why I rarely use it. Anything that wants to install a specialized driver, uh, I tend to, um, you know, stay away from that because you never know the effect it can have on a, a host computer especially if it's not your computer uh, it's not a good idea to uh, you know break something that's not broken already 
So once you've done that, it's going to restart, and hopefully, uh, you know, some of the stuff that's really, really bad is going to be removed. Uh, now, be warned that you don't use this alone. This is something you use, but you'll need to use it in conjunction with other pieces of software like, like my, MalwareBytes.org. Uh, the MalwareBytes anti-malware is a great piece of software. And so you can scan with MalwareBytes and with this TDSS killer and other tools that we're going to talk about in the next few videos. So look at all the videos. This is a full series on tools that are very useful for anyone that's infected with viruses. If you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, a problem, malware, anything, you can ask a question. Uh, there's some great people that actually are answering some of the questions on the channel, and I really, really appreciate that. And if I can't, I will, I can, I will, of course, um, you know, answer a question myself. So thank you for watching and hope to see you again on the Easy Computer Fixes channel.